The difference with Duplicy is he was signed to another organization. Oh! Dricus Duplessis has only been in the UFC since 2020 and already has made a huge splash in the world of mixed martial arts. This South African fighter has racked up multiple fight bonuses, has beefed with Israel Adesanya, and is set to face former champion Robert Whittaker at UFC 290. Love him or hate him, there's no denying Duplessis is talented and here to stay. One of the first fights that made UFC fans take notice was when Duplessis faced Marcus Perez at UFC Fight Island 5. Make a difference when you're taking a fight on short notice and you've not had the time to build it up in your head. The difference with Duplessis is he was signed to another organization. Oh! Duplessis wasted no time and in round one landed a huge shot on Perez that scored him a KO victory in his UFC debut. Duplessis would earn his very first Performance of the Night award in only his second fight where he faced Trevin Giles at UFC 264. There's no tell on it, so it just kind of goes up towards your head. Oh, there we go, good shot. Good shot. Oh! only two fights, Duplessis made a huge statement and quickly shot up the rankings. With performances like this so early in his UFC career, it's easy to see why UFC fans are already familiar with the name Dricus Duplessis. Duplessis would take on established middleweight fighter Brad Tavares at UFC 276 and prove he was ready to take on the division's best. Yeah. And look Brad, at Tavares, right? Yeah. Tavares is just kind of settled. Oh, oh Drake is hurt. Nice combination there with the hands by Duplessis. Now yeah. goes to the uppercut. Duplessis is loading up, <laughs> like really loading up. Ooh. Oh, another one by Drake. Heavy hands from Duplessis moving forward. Oh, he caught him with that left. Good check hook, caught him coming in. Oh! What oh, a fight wow. through 10 minutes! But then he gets hit with the end of the punch. There it is. Oh! It's heavy power coming yeah. from Duplessis. The boy is he loading up. Oh! Beautiful spin. Duplessis would go every round, proving to fight fans that he has a gas tank and wasn't just a knockout artist. Drickus took home yet another win, only this time by unanimous decision. It was clear at this point that Duplessis needed some stiffer competition. So at UFC 282, the South African would face former championship challenger Darren Till. Duplessis put on a showcase for his ground game. Give him a fight! Oh, beautiful jab. Good left counter hand. left top. And that's what Drake is talking about, right, Joe? Not rushing. And when he doesn't rush, he's, he's landing. And so is Till, though. Till's just kind of poking at him with that jab. Oh, right in the mouth. Look at that. Oh, and a big right hand greets Till when he gets to the floor. That's a huge moment for Duplessis. There's the tap. Just like that. Drake is Duplessis. Forward on the UFC and coming to the top ten next week. In round three, Duplessis scored a takedown and quickly sunk in a choke that forced Till to tap. This was yet another win for Duplessis, bringing his win streak up to four. Finally, in his most recent matchup, Duplessis faced number eight in the middleweight rankings, Derek Branson. It was a wild fight in classic Duplessis fashion, setting Drickus up for his upcoming match against former champion Robert Whitaker. Oh, oh, he hit him with a left hand there. Oh, he landed oh, something hurt there. Kick to the body there too by Duplessis. Oh, oh, oh big left he's hand. Him. He's done him for oh, sure. Bad. Derek got really rocked there. Patient Duplessis, look at him. And then again, nice job with that low kick and caught him on the left hook. Derek, oh, right Derek from the trouble. South African now left. Derek is in a little bit of a trouble. Yeah, here. he is. He hasn't recovered. And sometimes in the past, we have been a little bit fooled by the Duplessis oh. exhaustion with that mouth open. Yeah, he says it. He goes, I'm not tired like you guys think every time. Well, yeah. Duplessis has a really bad mouth. Oh, he's touching very bad now. Beautiful. Oh, and again, stung him with that left. 
Brunson Corner said they want him on the ground. He's got him. He's in a real good opportunity here to, to stop this fight. Herb Dean is taking a close look. Derek's legs are just flying in the air. He's not effectively utilizing his guard. Oh! Oh! oh big shot! Oh! The, the towel. The towel just got thrown in. They just threw the towel over there. At the end of round two, Duplessis landed a left hand from the ground that caused Brunson to stop the fight. Israel Adesanya is eager to fight this rising star, but can Duplessis make it past Whitaker first? Do you think Duplessis can beat Whitaker? Let us know in the comments. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe and check back every week for more Ultimate MMA.